Well, welcome again to West Craig Hill Drive. <coughs> this past Sunday was the first Sunday in Advent. Christmas will soon be with us. Now, since most of us are not physically able to be present in church where an Advent wreath would be lit, I thought our meditation could revolve around setting up an Advent wreath. We are putting our Advent wreath here together at home. Normally, the Advent wreath has three purple candles, one for the first and second and fourth weeks, and a pink candle for week three, and we would basically be halfway through Advent, and then a white Christ candle in the middle. So, let us begin with these opening words. Today is the beginning of, Ad, of, the Ad, of Advent, the preparation time for celebrating Christ's birth. We are here because God's promises to our ancestors came true when Jesus was born. God's promises kept each Sunday when we worship because Christ is in our midst. God will keep the promise to come again in glory. And from the prophet Isaiah, the 60th chapter and the second verse, For darkness shall cover the earth, and thick darkness the peoples. But the Lord will be rise upon you, and his glory will appear over you. Now we light this candle to proclaim the coming of the light of God into the world. With the coming of this light, there is hope. Because of Christ, we not only have hope, but we believe good is stronger than evil. And God wants us to work for good in this world. And now here is where you would light your candle. And let us pray together. O oh God, we thank you that Jesus brought hope into our world. By the good news of the Bible, you are still bringing hope to people. Help us to be ready to welcome Jesus Christ so that we may think good thoughts and do good deeds, and so that we may be a people of hope in our world. Amen. And then, here is where we would sing a hymn. So let me suggest that you, in your mind, think about the hymn, Watchman Tell Us All the Night, which goes like this. Watchman, tell us all the night what its signs of promise are. Traveler o'er oh, wondrous sight, see that glory beaming star. Watchman, does its beauteous ray news of joy or hope foretell? Traveler, yes, it brings the day, promised day of Israel. Well, brothers and sisters, this concludes our, concludes our meditation for this week. In each of the next three weeks, we will celebrate the lighting of the appropriate candles. Next week, we will light the candle of peace. The third week we will light the candle of love. The fourth week we will light the candle of joy. And on Christmas Eve and or Christmas Day, we will light all four candles as well. That's the, Christ, the white Christ candle that is in the middle. God bless you and have a wonderful day. See you next week as we light the candle of peace.